Hello, welcome to a publisher tutorial. I haven't done a publisher tutorial for quite a while, and I must admit, working with a lot of corporate clients, I don't get a lot of call for it. But this is this video is specifically in answer to somebody who requested about not having page numbers on the first page or second page or whatever page you want the page numbers to start on. So this tutorial is tutorial is about getting your page numbers to start at a specific page. So how do you get your page numbers to start at a specific page? Well, first thing we need to do is we need to put in page numbers. So um, I've got a, you can see here, I've got a, a Power BI beginners cover there. That's our little website, our Power BI training course. We've got a little cupcake there. So something that you might want to do a brief notes in publisher. Uh, what you would then end up doing is you would end up going to insert and then there should be page numbers here and you decide where you're going to put it. So I'm just going to put it in the bottom center. Okay, so now the bottom center has page numbers. But if I look down here and I just zoom in, oops, there we go, just hold control. And you can see that's on page two. Now, page two might have sort of acknowledgments, for instance. It might have, say, for instance, um, uh, extra information like page three might have a table of contents on it. So let's just say, for instance, we want our, let's say on page three, I tell you what, we're going to start our page numbers again. So how do we do that? Well, it's all through sections. So very briefly, this is how you do it. You're going to right click on page three and then go up to and click on insert section. So now you can see this little button just here. If I just zoom in, you can see that shows a beginning of that new section. In fact, if I click on the drop down list, it collapses that section and I've got the top one, I can collapse that section as well. So now what I wanna do is I wanna restart the page numbers. I don't want it to start at page three. So what I do is I right click on the page number. I'm gonna to go to page numbers here and I'm going to uh, go to format page numbers. So if I just zoom in so you can absolutely see it clearly so there we go page numbers and then format page numbers there okay oh, let's do that again right click page numbers format page numbers great excellent so now i want to start this section with page number one that's great click on okay and that starts on page number one there that's great so now we've got page number Number one, starting on page three. You have to keep track of this. It's so easy to get confused. So what I want now is these two pages here, page one and page two. I don't want any page numbers on. So I select both of them by holding down the shift key on the keyboard. And I'm going to right click on that. And then I say on this one here, I'm going to apply master pages to this. I'm going to say none for that. So there's no master page applied to this one. So now if I go to the next page here, I can see that starts on page one. If I go to this page here, because these are no master pages are applied to it. Okay, so just a little bit of understanding of what's going on. If you click on the view tab just here at the top of the screen, uh, and then if you go to um, master page, you can see that's where it puts the page number. That's how it adds the page numbers in. It's basically like going to the my master page, drawing a text box, and then going insert page number, and then um, insert in current text box, text box. I need to make sure I'm in there, there we go. And then insert in current text box. It's like doing that. Uh, if I just go back to and close my master pages up. So then you select both of these pages by holding down the shift key, right clicking, and then go to master pages and make sure that there's no master page applied. And that is it. So there, hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to get your page numbers to start on a specific page. And I hope it answers the question. You know who you are. Um, please, if you've got anything out of this, please subscribe to this channel. Um, please click on the notification icon as well and give it a thumbs up. If you've liked anything, give it a little thumbs up. I'd really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.